the 1972 Miami Dolphins. The 1972 Miami Dolphins remain the only NFL team to complete a perfect season, finishing with a 17-0 record, including a Super Bowl victory. Inside Lawrence Taylor's Hall of Fame career. Lawrence Taylor is undoubtedly one of the greatest football players of all time. His Hall of Fame career is a testament to his incredible talent, unmatched skills, and unmatched passion for the game. In this video, we will take a closer look at the inside story of Lawrence Taylor's journey to the Hall of Fame. Early Life and College Football Lawrence Taylor was born on February 4, 1959, in Williamsburg, Virginia. Growing up in a low-income neighborhood, he faced numerous challenges and hardships. However, his love for football helped him escape the tough surroundings. Taylor attended Lafayette High School, where he quickly made a name for himself as a standout athlete. His exceptional performance on the football field caught the attention of college recruiters across the nation. Ultimately, Taylor accepted a scholarship to the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill. During his time at UNC, Taylor established himself as a dominant force on the football field. He was known for his speed, agility, and hard-hitting tackles. In his sophomore year, Taylor was named an All-American, securing his place as one of the most talented players in college football. NFL Draft and the New York Giants After completing his college career, Taylor declared for the 1981 NFL Draft. The New York Giants had the second overall pick and were quick to select Taylor. Little did they know that this choice would change the fate of the franchise forever. Taylor's impact in the NFL was immediate. In his rookie season, he recorded 133 tackles, earning him the NFL Defensive Rookie of the Year award. His relentless pursuit of quarterbacks and disruptive defense played a significant role in the Giants' success. Throughout the 1980s, Taylor established himself as the most feared defensive player in the league. His versatility and ability to adapt to different situations made him an unstoppable force on the field. He revolutionized the outside linebacker position, redefining the way the game was played. Super Bowl championships and individual accolades. With Taylor leading the way, the Giants became one of the most dominant teams in the NFL. They won Super Bowl 21 in 1986, with Taylor earning the Super Bowl MVP award. His iconic performance in that game solidified his status as one of the greatest players in football history. Taylor's exceptional play continued throughout his career, earning him numerous individual accolades. He was named the NFL Defensive Player of the Year three times and was selected for the Pro Bowl ten times. In 1999, he was inducted into the Pro Football Hall of Fame, cementing his legacy as one of the all-time greats. Off-the-field struggles and legacy While Taylor's on-the-field career was filled with accomplishments, he faced multiple challenges off the field. He battled with drug addiction and had numerous legal issues. However, he eventually overcame these hardships and became an advocate for addiction recovery. Despite his struggles, Taylor's impact on the game cannot be ignored. He changed the way the linebacker position was played and set a standard of excellence for future generations. Many young players, including current NFL stars, credit Taylor as their inspiration and role model. Conclusion Lawrence Taylor's Hall of Fame career will forever be remembered as one of the most remarkable in NFL history. His unmatched skills, passion, and dedication to the game made him a true legend. Although he faced personal challenges, Taylor's impact on the field and off it remains influential. He will always be celebrated as one of the greatest players to ever grace the football field.